Hi, this is Preston from Webvantix and uh, talking briefly about how to get these categories that you see here in our blog into the sidebar of your blog on, in WordPress. And one of the reasons why it's so important to have the categories show up in your sidebar is so that people who are navigating into your blog can very quickly find what they're interested in. Of course, one of the things that I've talked about before in other posts is to give the ability to your site's visitors the information that they want at that minute as quickly as possible so that they stay on your site and spend more time on it. So we're going to take a look actually at a site that we developed called springfieldchefs.com and as you can see here this is their blog page and they haven't gotten their categories up yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back into their dashboard and I'm going to show you how to do it very quickly. The sidebar is controlled under the appearance tab and the link for widgets. Widgets are essentially tools that show up in your sidebar and they come pre-populated with some of the widgets that are available. A lot of a lot of them are available to add in as plugins but some are very basic and come with WordPress. One of them is categories. So very very simply all you have to do is you mouse over categories and you can take it and drop it right into wherever you want it. So effectively you can drop it uh, right up here under the search tab if you'd like and there you go and as you can see there are other widgets that can be dropped into place as well for instance like a tag cloud you can go in and you can put it right wherever it is that you want it and that's very simple just to take it drag it drop it and that's it so let's go back in actually over to Springfield Chefs now that that's been dropped into place and show you we're gonna hit refresh and show you exactly what it looks like and there are the categories that are in Springfield Chefs. One of the things that's also very important in regards to categories and why you should create them is SEO. Search engine optimization is key for any website, of course, and one of the things that is what I like to call low-hanging fruit in SEO is if you have a blog and you use WordPress, it's very easy to create categories and each one of those categories that you create is going to be looked upon as a keyword by Google. So very interestingly what can happen is depending upon the categories that you create you can have people coming to your site or your site being sh showing up when people Google certain things. So for instance if someone Googled uh, Argentina Steakhouse in Springfield, Missouri there's a good chance that this blog post about Argentina Steakhouse might come up and if it does they would obviously have the opportunity to click on it and then read about it in your blog and enhance your SEO. So this is Preston Erler. I hope this has given you a quick primer on how to get categories into your sidebar in WordPress. Thanks very much. 